convicted and disgraced politician is vying for a political comeback, but his past could stand in the way. As CBS 2's Hazel Sanchez report, uh, reports Hiram Montserrat is hoping voters are forgiving. On the streets of Central Queens are two city council candidates who tout plenty of experience for the job. 43-year-old Assemblyman Francisco Moya. Seven years as a New York State Assembly member. And 50-year-old former councilman Hiram Montserrat. Three decades of... Uh of public service. In this race, what the candidates will do takes a back seat to what they've already done, particularly Montserrat, who was expelled from the state Senate in 2010 after being convicted for assaulting his then girlfriend. In 2012, he pleaded guilty to improperly using city council money to finance his Senate campaign. I'm sorry about, about everything that I did that wasn't correct, but I have learned from that, and everyone deserves a second chance. We have to say goodbye to the scandals and the corruption of the past, and we have to move forward. Mayor de Blasio and Governor Cuomo are endorsing Moya, as is the National Organization for Women, known as NOW. Now NYC has been preparing to protest against votes for Montserrat outside primary polls tomorrow. He has proven himself to be both violent and corrupt. Those are not very good combination for uh, a leader. He's a big liar and a big thief. Many in this Queens district disagree. Everybody has a chance to be forgiven. Everybody has a chance to repent. And Montserrat has done both. You can't change what's in the past, so you got to look for the future. Right now, we need him in this community. Typically, only a few thousand people in this district cast their vote in a primary, with Moya having powerful Democrat endorsements and Montserrat having a deep-seated relationship with this community. The race is expected to be tight. In East Elmhurst, Queens, Hazel Sanchez, CBS2 News.